So wait, Mike, are you going to play those phone calls or anything? Or? Yeah. Okay. Uh, oh, no. well. Um, so I really, so we, we did some uh, on the field research. And yeah. Mike, uh, um, basically, um, uh, I, I feel really <clears throat> uh, bad about doing it, but I called up some people and asked them some questions about potatoes. <laughs> um, just trying to get a feel uh, for how much 75,000 pounds of potatoes would cost a man. Uh, it basically <laughs> goes to like this. Uh, hey, how many fucking potatoes you got? And they're like, I ah, not why well, I don't want to talk to you. I can tell, uh, even though uh, uh, you'll hear it. It sucks. <laughs> I can't wait to hear it. I can't fucking wait. Hi, um, is this the uh, the potato company? Okay, uh, I, I have a I have a question. It's a bit of an odd question, um, so I, I don't want to to put you off. Um, but I'm basically uh, doing some window shopping um, for a production that I'm working on, and I just wanted to know uh, a, a price estimate if I could get one. One box. Um, well, so as, as I said, it's a bit of an odd request. Um, so we're we're working on a movie. Um, and we're, we're using, uh, basically potato flakes as fake snow. Um, so we're looking for a bulk order. Um. Okay, we don't do the flakes here. Okay. Um, okay, thank you. You're welcome. Bye-bye. Damn it. Water Farms, this is Annie Jo. Hi, um, I, uh, I have a... I'm looking for a price estimate um, for a, a bulk order of potato flakes. Is that something that you guys do? No, we only have raw potatoes. Okay. Um, okay. Thank you. Oh, God, I hate it. In my <laughs> mind, these fucking assholes are working at a call center in Idaho, and they, they who doesn't want to talk to somebody who's making a movie? Or so they think. But it turns out... They're not so easily fooled. <laughs> um, and let me tell you something. Nobody wants to give you the flakes. They want to give you the whole potato, and then you have to flake it yourself, which is like, yeah, am I fucking criminal, number? frankly? Water Farms, this is Annie Jo. Uh, hi, this is, uh, I, this is Mike Portnoy here. I, I just uh, spoke with you a moment ago. Um, I was just wondering what quantities you sell potatoes in uh, bulk-wise. Okay, hold on just a moment, please. Water Farms, this is Ben. Uh, hey, this is uh, Mike Portnoy here. I'm uh, I'm with Saturn Films. Uh, just looking to see uh, what uh, what quantities you sell like bulk potatoes in. Um, usually, we try to do at least ten pallets. Ten pallets, and how like how many pounds of potatoes is is a pallet? Two thousand pounds. Two thousand pounds. Okay, so that's roughly like twenty thousand pounds. Okay. Correct. Um, okay, and how much? What's the cost of that? Well, it depends what size you want, and what kind of pack, and if it needs to be delivered or you're picking it up. Gotcha. Uh, yeah, we're just kind of doing a cost comparison right now. Um. So if we were to have, uh, d like, say, 10 pallets delivered to Wisconsin, how much would that cost? What size potato do you want? Like, I, I need to know, like, the pack, how big the potato. Um, um, I'm afraid that's no problem. Yeah, I mean, it's it's the the potato is important. We're kind of we're gonna be uh, we're gonna be making flakes out of it. So uh, we're just kind of looking for quantity wise. Do you want a number one, USDA number one, or if it's flake, can you use a USDA number two or a process grade? Uh, yeah, the number two works. What, what would be the cost of that? Do you, do you want them in totes or like 50 pound bags? Um, matter. whatever is cheapest. Okay, so you're probably looking at a fit one 50 pound bag is probably going to be seven bucks. And that market does change, but just going off of today. Yeah. Looking at four dollars for eight, so you're looking at eleven dollars a unit. So you're looking at like forty four hundred bucks. Okay. Um, four hundred unit. Okay, and uh, what was your name again? Ben. Ben. Okay. Um, 
All right. We're, uh, thank you for the info. Uh, we're just, uh, like I said, still kind of cost comparison right now. Um, so I will, uh, I will give you a call back and, and with more information. Okay. Take care. Uh, yeah. So I, you know, I, I called around a few Idaho, uh, places. Uh, one of them, uh, didn't answer and they were the smart one. (laughs) (laughs) Well, nice, nice. Uh, but I'm glad you did some field research for us. I'm glad that you put the most effort into this podcast. Unlike some other people. Yeah. Look, I put in quite a bit of fucking work into this podcast. I pay attention to the movie. Oh, cool. Yeah. Uh, look at me. I watch um, a movie and write notes. I'm just, (laughs) Uh, I talked to a young man. I also uh, do all the editing. You <laughs> and you're going to sound like assholes after this. <laughs> I already sound like an asshole all the time. Yeah. Um, I already sound like an asshole constantly. <laughs> um, but I talked to a young fellow who could sell me 10 pallets of potatoes for uh, $4,400. Uh, and that's 20,000, 2,000 a pallet. 2,000 pounds of pallet. Uh, but so if uh, – so figure uh, you get four pallets. That's uh, – or, or, or four of the 10 pa- packs. Yeah. Uh, that's 80,000 pounds of potatoes for around, uh, say, $17,000 or something. I don't know. Uh, I didn't really do the math. Um, hmm. But – Well, you know, I wonder if those prices are being affected by our pandemic and the the potato shortages that are going on currently. Yeah. There, there's a there's an American potato famine. We're all, <laughs> yeah. we're all gonna have to emigrate back to Europe. Yeah, there's, well, because there's two two things that don't circulate: uh, coins and potatoes. Yeah. So basically, everybody is yeah. they they the, all the coins and potatoes are in everybody's houses uh, and not being used, not being circulated in the market. Yeah, people need to go so, out and buy more French fries. I think. Yeah, I remember or, hearing that. That's definitely like, a thing, American needs more of is buying more fast food yeah buy more fast food or buy things with fast food well that's like the last great american industry isn't it <laughs> <At this laughs> basically so, so good luck to all the potato mongers out there and have a good job <laughs> all right oh, well uh, so moving on now to